Dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus, today the 9th of February, Holy Mother the Church calls us to the memory of Saint Miguel Febrer Cordero. He was born as Francisco in the year 1854 in a place called Quiseca in Ecuador, South America. Miquel, or Francisco as he was called during his childhood, was born with a leg which was troubled. He was physically challenged. He had a feet which troubled him all his life. But this did not stop him from walking in the path of God. When he was at the age of 15, he joined the brothers, lay brothers, for Christian brothers for education. He joined them and then he was so well known for his uh, education methods that people flocked to him and students liked him. He wrote so many textbooks and so much so that his textbooks are used all throughout South America. But he is not known for this. He is famous, he is renowned for his catechetical teaching, the way in which he made catechism alive, catechism real for the students was real good and, and the way in which he prepared, it prepared the students for the First Holy Communion was really great. Uh, at a moment in Spain when anti-clerical uh, movement was happening, he was the one who who would see that the profanation of the sacred species is not done. So in order to save the sacred species from profanation, sometimes he used to walk 8 miles, 10 miles with a leg like his. Later, at the age of 56, he died out of pneumonia. Miguel Febra Cordero stands to us, dear brethren, has a beautiful example, my inability, my incapacity cannot take away my ability to be a saint. My physical inability or mental inability, psychological inability cannot stop me from being a saint. My inabilities should bring me much more closer to sanctity and make me and make my life as saint much more possible. Amen.